Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy IX. Um, I, to be honest, I don't know which episode this is. It's been a while since I recorded some, and I've still got about five or six more um, ready to go. So this uh, this won't be put out for another month or two yet. Um, but I do know that we had a little lot of side questions around here. We got all the little things we needed to get out of the way. We've Handed in our coins to the Cesalia woman or whatever she's called. We've been to the auction house, been to Vivi's old home, we've been to Dali, um, and we've seen some of the uh, AT or the ATEs as well. Um, so the next thing we're going to be doing then is there's a card tournament. Um, this is how we will be progressing the story. So we're going to go to the card tournament. Uh, you'll have noticed that I've not been playing the game. I've not got many good cards, but I do know how to play the game, uh, and hopefully I will be able to um, to pick up the victory and win the whole thing. What you can do is you can save after every match, and so if you do lose, say you get to the final and you lose, you can reload. I'm not saying that I'm going to do that, but I'm definitely going to do that. Uh, okay, so... Uh, what do you need to know about our... No, nothing. Registration for the card tournament is still open. You must win two games before you can challenge the champion. Fair enough. Fantastic prize. So there's a wait contestants who defeat the champion. It's amazing that we've got a stadium for this. What's the champion like? Lo and behold... Is he that amazing? Oh yes, very much so. Just tell me what he's like. Well... Whisper, whisper. Well what? She's a cutie in a sailor's uniform? Wow, I'd love to challenge her. See? Now go ahead and register. Sure, I'll register. Anything to meet this girl. Man, come on. What about Garnet? You're, regist you're registered now. Please enter through this gate. The game will, be, will begin automatically. Alright, excellent, let's go. Got a bit of a cold if you can hear it in my voice. Attic Man Wake. Uh, I wonder if this is the guy from Lindbloom. What, do I, what have I got? Oh no. I might have you. Oh, I must have got a good one here somewhere. No, just lots of piss ants. Okay. Oh, she was pretty cool. Oh. Oh, hello. So these are ones that I've earned just from winning battles. Uh, so I've got three power cards. Okay, I need to get some magic cards now. <coughs> what are you? Oh, I just hate seeing these numbers, but only seeing a few arrows. Uh, okay, let's see what we can do with this. Uh, let's just quickly put you down there. Okay, okay. You don't have anything frightening so far. Uh. Come on, take it. Yes, yes, yes. Ooh. You should... Tell you what, let's just quickly put you there for now. Hmm. No. You can get that one, that one, and that one. Thank <laughs> you. 
Yes. Yes. Whew, I thought I was going to lose then. Oh my god. Uh, I don't have a U yet. I must have got a U. Okay. Alright, that's one game down. Congratulations, advance to the second round when ready, or go out inside and play right now. Oh, good old days. Oh, it's you, Amaran. What are you doing? Looking at the lake? I thought you'd be the quiet type. Sorry, maybe I've changed. It's probably his influence. Saddam, huh? So, did you find what you were looking for? Well, I've been I've been investigating Kuja. Some people seem to think that uh, King, the owner of this mansion, is Kuja. True, I found people who witnessed Kuja on this. Uh, on his property, but there is no proof that Kuja is Lord King. Hmm. What do you know? Nothing really. Maybe I can find out the truth from the mansion's auctioneer. Don't hold your breath. So, what's your story? You seem to know your way around. Are you also here for a reason? Who, me? I'm only an unemployed security guard. Security guard? It was a painfully dull... It was painfully dull until the day he showed up. I've said too much. Hey, wait. What, you're interested about hearing about my past? Of course I am. Of course I'm interested. Hmm. What could his past be? <clears throat> so, as I said before, you can go and save it in between each game. Okay. Lessons of life. <coughs> this is where he and I met for the first time. Who is he? Zadar. I thought the two of you just met. I don't think he remembers. I was working as a security guard at this mansion. I was looking for a fight. It didn't matter who, as long as they were, as long as he was strong. Thief! That was too easy. Yeah. Who, who are you? You look like a worthy opponent. Hmm. So you're the king's family infamous new security guard, huh? What if I am? Hasn't got me any action yet. Come on, bite me. <clears> hmm. <throat> You're just a thug. What did you call me? My favourite kind. I'll knock you out in one minute flat. Ah. Don't disappoint me. Where did that thief go? Hee <laughs> hee, here they go. I won't let them interfere. Come on, don't be silly. The game's over. What? Help! He came out of that door as I was passing by. Uh, I was staring at him because I thought he might be a burglar. Then he started pummeling me. But he's a guard for this mansion. That's why he's suspicious. Just look at him. We, we always had our suspicions, but... I'm going to call the police. You guys hold him off until they get here. I'll tell you one thing. The truly mighty ones don't flaunt their power. How can I describe it to you? The sly eagle hides its, its claws. Hmm. I'm out here. Bye bye. We, we've got you now. Yeah, right. H hey! Don't run away! They didn't seem eager to give chase under the. So you. I became a wanted man. <laughs> What's so funny? Sorry, I just didn't expect you'd fall for such a childish trick. It's no concern of yours. I'm sorry. 
I see. So that's what happened. Don't get me wrong. I don't hold a grudge against him. But I need to understand him. He doesn't flaunt his power. He only cares about being with his friends. You were destined to meet each other again. Two men walking the same paths are destined to confront each other one day. That's what a man told me a long time ago. Some time ago. Honesty is a virtue. That's if you can manage to stay alive. Hmm. I, mean, I still think that Amar Amaran is, is a useless character and the game wouldn't change all without him. Uh, anything new? <laughs> so Zidane is responsible for Amaran being a wanted man and being infamous. I mean, he's. I mean, I'm assuming that since then he's. He's gone into the life of crime because people are scared of him. I doubt that people are scared of him just solely, solely based on that one crime that he was he was reportedly that he'd reportedly done. So yeah, okay. I've spoken to you before. The cat seems to be having a good time. I really love this. This whole city. It's really cool. Right, next game. Mm. You're a decent bait card at least. I'd love to use Shiva. It's going to be so cool. Where is she? There you are. No, yeah, we use you. Okay. Ooh, why would you do that? I mean, I can't get a perfect now, because I can't... I was, I was gonna get the Yeti after, but oh well. Uh... You've got one magic power defense, so we'll attack with you. Yes, nice. Ooh... Oh. oh yeah, battle's over. Yeah, all right. Okay. Congratulations, you won twice. Advance to the final round when ready. A word of caution: you might only have one chance to play in the final round, so you only have one chance to play in the final round. Be careful. Find the Moogle and save now if you have any doubts. Oh yeah, definitely have doubts. Hallucination. <laughs> Hungry. I try travel to to eat many foods from different cities. But why you need gill to eat anything? I couldn't eat without gill. We got loads of gill mates. That's that's us. Ah, light on water. Look like food. It's just illusion, but maybe real. I go jump in. No, if I I drown if I jump in. But I hungry. Hungry. <laughs> suicide, eh? I've seen many people commit suicide because of gambling debts. But yeah, what a shame. Rest in peace. Wow, dark.
Welcome back. Welcome back. How did you like Trino? Hmm, it was okay. Do you prefer your own village? Yeah, but it's fun to meet different people. I've only had my Moogles till now. Just the Moogles. What about the others? They're gone. I'm all alone now. I see. So you're the sole survivor of the Summoner tribe. Why does everyone want to know about that? My horn and the Eidolans? Oh, I'm a researcher of sorts. I'm just curious. I see. Oh yeah, you were Dagger's teacher, right? Well, yes. Teach me how to become a graceful princess like her. Ha <laughs> ha! The princess used to be a rumbustrous girl, just like you. Do you think I can just be like her when I grow up? Oh, of course. I'm glad to hear that. You see, Dagger gave me her mark of the princess. Mark of the princess? Yeah, Dagger gave me one of hers. So now she's got two and I've got two. Do you mean the legendary crystals? Yeah, that's what Dagger called them too. I, I see. So the crystals were was divided. One piece remained in Alexandria, while the others were sent to Clara, Lynn Bloom, and the Summoner tribe took the last piece to Madame Sare. But why did they have to split the crystal? What happened 500 years ago to prompt such action? Ah, uh, excuse me. I'm sorry. I do, I get lost in thought sometimes. Miss Aiko? Mog is calling me. Mog wanted to talk to a Moogle she met here in Trino, so I left her there. But something's wrong. I have a bad feeling about this. I gotta get to Mog. Ooh. Well, let's just see what this guy says about Queen. No, okay. Um, I mean, I mean, obviously, I was earlier. I was saying about Amaran and people. There is an argument that potentially Queena as well is one of those. But Queena's purpose is to be funny, is to be the comedy relief when you know the parts of the game can get quite dark. You know, not only that, but she did, but they did serve some sort of purpose. You know, we got to the outer continent because. Because of um, because of them, so you know at least as storyline wise, they provided something, and you know to to a player, you know I I personally find uh, find them funny, a bit one note at time, but you know just then that was that was a funny little scene. <clears throat> you know they, they, the story's got all serious all of a sudden. This way, Regent. Yes, I know. Remember my condition. Please, Regent, you must behave like a champion. Ah, let's register. It's the champion. Yeah, here she comes. I'm the champion, Erin. I'd like to enter the tournament, please. Ah, we've been waiting for you. Please go inside. Thanks. You, Dad, it's an oglop. Shoo, shoo. Go away, you filthy oglop. Um... I'm sorry, but this is my oglop. It's a champion's pet? I I'm sorry, it's okay. It's one of my, your pet. <laughs> well, you are an oglop right now, after all. Silence! I am the champion. Ah. No one understands. I had the champion as a master of winning games with Oglop cards. Her name is Erin the Oglop Master. Oglop cards, eh? Uh, yeah. 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 Here we go. This has been the team that's got me through to the final. <clears throat> okay. That has decent power. Let's just guard this. 
And got that. Oh, fuck, I'm in that one, man. Oh, oh, oh. Hmm. Okay, here we go. We're gonna go for a big one here. Yes. Yes. Yes! You won! And I'm not going there, because if I lose that, then I'll, I'll lose him as well. Boom. I'm the best around. Look at that, I have no practice. Rebirth ring. Oh, oh, oh yeah, that gives us something very special. Wow, I didn't know you were the champ, Erin. <clears throat> if I don't remember, we met Erin in the castle. Um, she's the one that wanted to uh, be the pilot for the next steam mistless or steam airship. Long time no see, Mr. Zidane. <clears throat> Don't be ridiculous. I'm the champion. Hey, Regent Sid. Still a knockoff, I see. And you still haven't learned any manners. Cut me some slack, will ya? What are you doing here, anyway? Merely participating in the tournament. But there was something I wanted to test. What are you testing? Our new airship, Hilda Guard 2. The one that can fly without mist? Correct. We can't go very fast yet, but we made it to Trino. Why now? I have a funny feeling there'll be more trouble in the, on the horizon. Don't you worry. I'm sure our almighty Queen Garnet will take care of everything. This is horrible. What's up, Aiko? No, it's horrible. A Moogle from Trino just told me. What's wrong? It's Alexandria. Something horrible is happening. Stop saying horrible. Oh. Peace is but a shadow of death, desperate to forget its painful past. Though we hope for promising years, after shedding a thousand tears, yesterday's sorrow constantly nears. And while the moon still shines blue, by dawn it will turn to scarlet hue. What an auspicious day for Alexandria. Garnet's ascension to the throne has brought hope and peace to this kingdom. The people are overjoyed. They believe a wonderful future is ahead of them. But the celebration isn't over yet. It's time to really light things up. Your former master is here, Bahamut. Play, play a requiem for her and all of Alexandria. Oh boy. Here we go. I don't want to die. Oh man, this is huge. It's like an Alexandria now. Here she is, Beatrix. Your Highness. That's Bahamut, isn't it? Why are you asking? You should know that. Beatrix, please gather, please gather our soldiers. Yes, Your Highness. Our soldiers have already assembled and await your orders. Okay, so we're going to end the episode here, and then we're going to start with the um, the defense of Alexandria Castle. So I will see you guys in the next episode. Uh, thank you very much for watching and um, supporting the series. I'll see you all soon. Take care. Bye-bye.